Hello Maths Lovers, in this video I am going to teach you how to square a two digit number within two seconds or even less. So one thing I want to share with you before we start this lesson. In Vedic Mathematics, more than the technique, the thing that matters is how much you practice and in what way you practice. Okay? Thousands of students have taught Vedic Maths. I started teaching when I was 18. So this number, yes. <laughs> so at that time I started teaching this Vedic Mathematics and all kind of Maths. The thing that matters is a lot of practice and type of practice that we do. Okay. So we will learn the technique now. See carefully. First of all, how to do it. 8 square, you do the square of this number and that is 64. So we will write just the unit digit and take 6, carry it forward. Now multiply these two digits and double it. 8 from the 8 and double is 16. 16. And this 6 we need to add to that 16. So 16 plus 6 is 22. 2 will be written here and 2 will be carried for because 22 it was so unit digit 2 will be written here and 2 will be carried forward and now square of this number 1 square is 1 and add it to 2 1 plus 2 will be 3 right so the answer is 3 to 4 but if you keep on writing you will not be able to do it that fast so the technique how we think how we do it mentally. See, when you are doing the square of this number, so as we got 64, right? The 4 you got, you can take it on your right hand. So you can just show your 4 fingers to yourself. So you know that your unit digit is 4. What if the number is greater than 5 because we have only 5 fingers including thumb? Then in that case, you see your right hand. In your four fingers, there are three cells in each finger. So 12 cells are there, isn't it? Usually. And if you get some greater number than five, like you get six. So what you do, you start counting from your first finger cells. So one, two, three, and then come to second finger, four, five, six. So you'll get six. So with thumb you can point, okay, I am at 6, isn't it? So right now you are at 4, so simply 4 fingers you can show to yourself, okay, quickly. And then that 6 that you have carried forward, that is in your mind. No need to do anything with that, right? So mentally we are doing like this. Then multiply these two numbers in your head and then double it. 8 ones are 8 to the 16. And then that 6 that you have carried forward, 16 plus 6 is 22, okay? So that 2, 22, the unit digit 2, you take in your left hand, right? Again, if the number is greater than 5, you can again use it as I've already told you with the right hand, right? So two fingers I'm showing to myself. And now two I have taken carried forward. That is in my mind, right? And then square this number. So one square is one and that two that you carried forward, one plus two is three. So 3, you got the number in your head and left hand is showing 2 and right hand is showing 4. So the answer will be 324. So on practicing this again and again, every day, just 10-15 minutes, every day, I'm not asking of 1 hour of practice. You can be perfect. Now let us see 26 square, how to do this. Again, so I'm sure you'll use your hands this time, right? So 6 square is 36, 6 on your right hand. 3 carried forward. Okay, so I'm writing here because right now I'm explaining. Later on we'll be doing live practice. Then we'll see what you can do. And then multiply these two numbers and double. 6 to the 12, 12 to the 24. And this 3 carried forward. So 24 plus 3 is 27. In your left hand you take 7. And now 2 in your head. And now square this 2 square is 4 and 4 plus 2 is 6. So the answer is 676. Without writing. And slowly, slowly, as you practice more, you will not even require your hands. You will memorize it. It's very easy. 
So once you start training your brain, it will memorize things. So slowly brain gets trained once you start working on it. Okay, let us see next question, 43 square. So 3 square 9. Take it on your right, uh, right hand. Then 4 3 is a 12. 12 2 is a 24. Double it. 24 on your left hand. And 2 in your head. So 4 square is 16 and 2. That will be 18. I hope it is clear. Right? And in next video when I will be teaching a square of 3 digit number. This technique is going to help you. Okay. Let us proceed. 8 square. 64. 4 in your right hand. 6 taken forward. I will write it here for you. But it is in the head. 8 6 are 48. Double of 48 is 96. 96 plus 6 is 102. So you will just write 2 here. 10 in your head. And now 6 square is 36. 36 plus 10 will be 46. So the answer is 4624. Okay. So we are increasing numbers gradually. Okay. Now larger number 74 square. So 4 square is 16. 6 here in your right hand and 1 carried forward in your mind and then multiply. So and for the 28, double of 28 is 56 plus 1 is 57. So 7 here, 5 here. 7 square is 49. Okay. And 49 plus 5 is 54. So again we have done it very quickly and if we wouldn't have written it then we could have done it even faster. Again 9 square is 81. 1 I have kept in right hand. 9 it is a 72 and 72 square is 144. Okay I will ask you what was the carried forward number? 8 it was right and what is the product? 72 and double is 144. 144 plus 8 is 152. Right? So I will write 2 here. And 15 I will carry forward in your head. So your left hand has 2 fingers. Right hand has 1 finger. And our 8 square is 64. Isn't it? What I have carried forward? Can you tell me? <laughs> this is the practice we require. The number that we carried forward was 15. So 8 square is 64, 64 plus 15 will be 79, okay? So by this time students will be thinking that, okay, this is a serious thing. No, adding numbers is not that tough. Okay. Just practice two session has started. Let us start quickly, okay? So 32 square, think by yourself, well, what will be the answer, right? Four seconds. So the answer is 1024. Is it correct? Check. 1024. 2 square is 4. 3 to the 6. Double of 6 is 12. 2. 1 carried forward. 3 square is 9. 9 plus 1, 10. 1024. Perfectly correct answer. Okay. Right. Next question. Be fast. Yeah. Do it. Right. So the answer is 2809. Did you got the correct answer? I hmm? will explain you. 3 square is 9, then 5 3 is a 15, 15 double is 30. So in left hand how to take 0, just make a punch, it is 0. So 0, 3 carried and 5 5 is a 25, 5 square is 25 and 3 that is carried will be 28. So the answer is 2809, got it? Okay now, third question, 62 square, can you do it quickly? Yes, 4 seconds. Right, stop. So the answer is 3844. Four. Is it correct? Let us check. Square of 2 is 4. So in right hand we have 4. Then 6 to the 12, double of 12 is 24. Again 4 here. 
2 carried forward 6 square is 36 and 36 plus 2 that was carried forward 38. So the answer is 3844. Right? Okay. Now 99 square. What is the answer? Yes, do. Got the answer? The answer is nine eight zero one. So let me tell you one thing here. <laughs> this here I didn't apply the technique that I taught you. I did a bit of trick here. You remember a video I posted where I taught you how to multiply numbers which are closer to 99, 999, 9999. If you haven't seen that video, go to the playlist and in Maths Tricks, Vedic Maths, you see that video. There I taught how to multiply numbers which are closer to 99, 98, 97, 96 like that. So there I applied this technique. So I want to multiply 99 with 99 okay so i am just repeating it once if you don't know what is 99 minus 100 99 minus 100 is minus 01 okay true similarly this 99 minus 100 is minus 01 so like this you can try it and now simple your answer is 99 minus 1 is 98 And 1 into 1 will be 1. So 0, 1 into 0, 1 is 0, 1. Right? So what I did simply, I know 99 minus 100 is minus 1. So I did 99 minus 1. That is 98. Okay. And then 1 into 1 is 1. And here you can just put a 0. Similarly, I will teach you 98 square. 98 square. What is 98 square? Think how, what is the difference between 98 and 100? That is 2. So 98 minus 2 you do, that will be 96. And now 2 twos are 4. And put a 0. So this is how you will get 9604. So this technique <laughs> is a bonus for you. This technique is applicable if a number is closer to 99, 98, 97, 96, 95, you can easily apply this technique.